All right, this training video is going to walk you through your back office. To get to your back office, you're going to type in www.myzaya.com, no slash, there's no backslash, and then you're going to come down here and it's going to say representative ID. This is the number that was emailed to you when you signed up, and then they also gave you a temporary password, which you'll enter here. So this is our home screen. This is where all of um, the main information that you're going to need to know. At the top, I'm going to cover it so that you don't all see my personal information. At the top, it will say the rank that you are qualified at. It will also tell you your monthly personal volume that you have so far for the month and also the previous month's personal volume. Over here, you're going to find company news and information as well as our return and exchange address, our customer service phone number, and then a list of our temporary out of stock products and the sizes that they're out of stock in. Now these dates right here are actually just tentative dates. So don't promise anybody those, obviously with shipments and customs, we never know when something's really coming in. These are our best estimates, sometimes every four, sometimes they're a couple days after. So just be aware of that. And obviously we are always getting in new stuff and so this is an always this um, list is always changing over here you have a few tabs we're going to go over a few of them some of them i'll click in some of them i won't um, under accounts are different orders that have been placed for you um, that you have placed personally um, or for your customers so that you can kind of pull those up commissions is where you're going to check how much you made that month and what um, rank you qualified at as well they are usually posted after the 10th of the month or after the 5th of the month and you are paid usually around the 10th to the 15th of the month your downline this is where you can run reports on your entire downline or individuals in your downline to see who's close to rank advancing or um, just general information about each of your reps i'm not going to pull that up so that i don't pull up everyone's personal information and the sales that they have had but that is where you can run downline reports I won't run a full downline report, but you can individualize which month you want to pull up um, for certain reasons. You can you can also, you know, speci specify your page size and any other specifics. I mean, we have a ton that you want to um, put into your into your report. And then once you do that, you can click the button at the bottom or also click here to run your report. Our company files, this is huge. There are so many documents here that you need to get in, um, get familiar with. So here's our catalog. If you push this tiny, tiny little triangle at the side, it will drop down and then you can pull up our newest catalog, which is super helpful to have at parties. If you pull them up um, at, um, like if you have at parties on an iPad, that if you don't have the newest um, catalog, that's super helpful. And then we also have games that you can play at um, different parties, gift cards that you can print out. I mean, we have a ton of things. Our, in our leadership calls are here. We have product photos, lifestyle photos, logos, new rep training, all of our newsletters, our rep map. We also have a return label that you can send to your customers. Um, which actually doesn't pay for their return. It just gives the information um, of where to send it back and the return ID number. A startup guide that you can print. You got one when you st signed up and then a style guide. So there's so much information on here. I would go through if I were you and click on each of those little triangles and open up those so that you can um, know the, your back office inside and out and all the information that you need. Events is where you will go, and we will go over this more um, in the future, is where you go to create parties. So this is where you would go, and we'll go over this, like I said, to create party events. And then this is where it will show you all of your events, the total that they have accrued, and how many orders, so that you are aware if they have or have not qualified for a party. Let's see. Your profile, okay, so this is where you're going to go to, and I already walked you through personalizing your website, to personalize your website and also enter all of your personal information. As like your cards, you can keep a card on file so that when you purchase items, you don't have to keep going and getting your credit card. So you could keep a card on file. You can also manage the alerts that are sent to you through email of things that come through your back office like sales or if people um, are interested in hosting a party and all of those things. You can, this is where you're going to go to change your password um, with the password that um, corporate has sent to you. 
so you can create a password that is um, something that you can remember. This is where you're going to link your social media account. This is where to, under commissions options is where you will add your checking information for direct deposit or change your checking, like if you need to change it, that's where you're gonna go for that. And then your website information, this is where you're gonna go to personalize your website. So you're gonna go to my website information, personalize, and you're going to, you know, the name that you want it to show on your website, um, it'll be at the bottom of your website, I want my personal name, and then my website name. So instead of doing my rep number, which is 1006, I did Sarah. Um, so I can keep changing that if I want to, but I want to keep it consistent. So I just did Sarah on that, and then you can add a bunch of different codes to do um, that will come up when people are searching. Close, and then you're going to hit update your profile. You can also upload a picture that will come at the bottom of your website. Next, we have our order history. Um, this keeps a tab of all of the orders that your customers have placed and then you can also get the details um, and if there is a shipping um, tracking it will be there. Next this is where you're going to go to place an order. We will go over that um, shortly. We have business tools order, individual customer order, party order, personal order, back orders, bookings, contacts, certi gift certificates, follow-ups, returns, and subscriptions. So we will kind of go over all of that here shortly. This is just kind of a brief overview of where to find everything. This is where you can go to register for different company events that we have coming up. We do not have anything yet um, that's showing in here, so there's nothing there. Here is where you can send an email to um, corporate. We also have this little button right here that will bring up a chat and you can send a question to customer service as well. Um, they usually get back to you within the day. If you, you can also send an email obviously through here or just send an email at cs at ziaactive.com to get an even faster um, Depends on how the day is going, which one's faster, but I usually like to send a couple different ways. So that is your back office, and I hope that if you have any questions, um, ask your sponsor that is just above you, or you can send me an email. My name is Sarah Anderson, and my email is andersarefor at gmail.com.